for another round of Resident Evil 2. DualShock version. Resident Evil 2. DualShock. So it's been a while since I streamed with this equipment, so um, so if the stream just randomly dies out, I apologize in advance, but hopefully it doesn't. Hey, what's up, Ninja? How's it going, man? So we're all done with Last of Us and the DLC, so now we're back to our old hijinks of playing games like this. I'm fine, but Ada is wounded because Ada runs out in front of me all the time so and I'm pretty sure I got everything in this room. Thanks Onion, how's it going man? I figured since you were awake I would play this game for you because I know you like uh, Resident Evil. I do too. And now I just gotta figure out where the fuck to go. Wait a minute. What kind of weapons do I have? Okay, I have a shotgun. I don't know if there's gonna be something that happens. I forgot to put the um, the ink ribbon away, but Yeah, leave Ada outside and then she'll be like, Whoa, all over the place. Can you guys hear me okay? Damn, that animation is not too bad actually for, uh, for 19, what, when did this game come? 1998? For 1998, that's pretty good animation. Not that animation, that animation. Ada! Ada! Can you hear me? Come on, snap out of it! Of course the dialogue's too low to you.
Oh, come on, really? There were bullets there? Yeah, this is a part of the game of the game where you need really good controls. But guess what? There are no really good controls in Resident Evil games. They didn't start doing that until Resident Evil 4, and by then they changed the way that Resident Evil games are. So, oh, well, at least this time I can bring the I'll bring the Magnum with me this time. I knew that was going to happen, but didn't realize I'd be all, like, gimpy and shit with the controls. <laughs> oh, yeah, I will take all the Magnum bullets, and where's the Magnum? Where's the fucking magnet? There. God, the Magnum's like the most hardcore gun right now. There are... Obviously, there's more hardcore guns, like Anin was saying, if you play, uh... If you play the arranged version, they basically give you a... They give you a submachine gun with unlimited ammo, which makes the game basically unplayable because it's so fucking easy. Actually, I didn't go over here last time. Let me see if there's anything over here. Nope. Enough. Damn, 18, well, more than that, like, a lot of fucking bullets. Get out of my way, bitch. There. Now I'm ready to kick some fucking ass.
Decided it would be a good idea to use one of those horns from uh from basketball games. That's fucking annoying. Can I get this scene? Okay, good. Ada, Ada, can you hear me? Come on, snap out of it. God damn it, Ada. Yeah, she's unconscious. We'll be prohibited for a limited time, leaving enough time for a battle with a uh, convenient battle with uh, whatever the fuck that thing is called. I can't remember. It's not called the Tyrant. Uh, I think So it already has a head, but it grows another head for no reason. Fucking killed you, bitch. That's the power of the Magnum pistol, motherfucker. Hey. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I keep singing that song uh, from, uh, from Guardians of the Galaxy. I actually saw it in theaters again with my roommate because the movie's so badass. <laughs> Seriously, go see that movie, but don't go see Ninja Turtles. I heard it sucks. And rightly so. It has Michael Bay's name on it. So it can go, like, you know, to hell. Die on me, Ada. Come on. Wake up. Come on. <laughs> like saying come on will actually help you. Or help her recover. Like, come on, recover, Ada, come on. We're inside dying. Umbrella's secret lab. I'll go find something to treat that wound, so just rest here in the meantime. But I'll only slow you down with these injuries. Go. Save yourself. I told you, it's my job to look after you. But you'll be in danger if you stay with me. I know I've only known you for a short period of time. I really enjoy being with you. <laughs> Jesus. I... I know. I'm not capable of caring about anyone. But... What? I don't want to lose you. We're leaving this place together. Wait here for me. I'll be right back. That was definitely a bit of Japanese dialogue. Only a Jap would say something like that. Like, like I'm not capable of loving you. 
uh, we're going to lose each other, blah, 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 blah. That is definitely something that, that an American would probably not say, but I don't know. Oh, well now I'm only the good caution. I'm not the bad caution. Yes, I will take more magnum bullets. Fuck yeah. I want to say hi to you, damn it. Yeah. Well, let me equip. So, yeah, I can't talk, talk to her, I guess. Is there anything else in this room? Probably not. Eh, Oh. Yes, I would love to take another ink ribbon. Jesus. Oh, and there's a chest in here too. What do you know? Well, I'm pretty sure I don't need the magnum for a while, so I might as well save the space. Do I have any herbs by themselves? No, I didn't think so. Well, let's just save then. Might as well. In these streams, I'm not really going for uh, any kind of achievements, which there are quite a few achievements in Resident Evil 2. Um, actually, I would be so bold to say that the Resident Evil series is the game, is the series that basically started the whole achievement thing. It's like the only reason you see achievements now in every single video game now is because of uh, the Resident Evil series, because they're the first ones to popularize it, I think. But I could be wrong about that. Shaft. Five. Okay, now we came back down here. It's over here. Oh yeah, yeah, I know where I'm at. Do you remember, do you guys remember there was a game, like, a Resident Evil game in between 4 and 5? I can't remember what it was called. But God, did that game suck. Where you like, where you like basically uh, go over like past Resident Evil games and stuff, and you go through like labs like this with different characters. The game was just so horrible though. It was just fucking awful. In my opinion. I can't remember what it was called. Yay. But I can go in here, I guess. door opens, it's like, yeah, oh yay, first aid spray, yay, 
Yes, of course I will. The first date is great. What's this? This case? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right, that's right. I, I remember this part. But you just picked up a fucking fuse case. Douchebag. Well, that was kind of easy to find. I love that sound. It sounds like a monster. Damn it, I forgot. Run away, run away, fuck. Yeah, now you need to run before you get fucked. It still walks unharmed. Hmm. It still locks unharmed. Hmm. Interesting. How do you know it's a researcher's bed? Couldn't it just be a bed?
Venom kills, that's actually a good idea. Let me, let me go do that, actually. You gotta make sure you're in the right spot, though, because this game hates that, so. <laughs> Yeah, fuck you! Blah. Okay. Oh, you can, now you can go in there? That's sweet. I totally forgot about that part. Thanks, man. Okay, fuck you. Shoot! Okay, now I need to use this stuff. Okay. Thank you for that, Venom Kills. I remember it took me a long time to figure that out the first time I played this game. Let's see here. Another fucking ink ribbon? Okay, why not? I thought this game was actually harsh on you with the ink ribbons. It's actually the opposite. They give you, like, three times as many as in the first game. What's this? Yay, more ammo. <laughs> Fucking. <laughs> Think I got enough shotgun shells? <laughs> Anything else in here? No. I unlocked it. Woohoo. Not that there's any reason to come back in there, but. Oh, okay. Well, I don't need to go in there anymore. Actually, I want to go in there. Yeah. Yeah. I should probably... Ooh. By the way, if you're new to my stream, please uh, hit the follow button beneath the video because I do stream games like this all the time. I don't necessarily stream older games, I just stream games that I like, which happen to include older games, so... Did I get poisoned? Okay. I forgot about that, like the body can still poison you. Plant fills the room, yep. Yeah, it's a way bigger plant than the one in uh, the first game. <laughs> Is it just me, or does the pistol become utterly fucking useless in this game now? <laughs> Don't. I'm not fighting those things with the pistol. You fucking idiot. <laughs> yeah, you'd be a fucking idiot to fight those things with anything uh, less than a shotgun. Oh, I missed the flamethrower? 
Really? Uh, I didn't realize that. Let me go back and check. So yeah, I forgot to get that stuff. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, he's dead. Okay. It's too late to get this. See, I don't know all this stuff, guys. So I guess uh, if you want to get those parts, you can play the game yourself. I don't know. That probably was a waste of ammo, but whatever. It's too late to get the shotgun parts. Okay. Um. <sighs> okay. Do you mean this locker? Oh, here's the flamethrower. Okay. Not that I really want the flamethrower right now, but whatever. God, those things are still here? Jesus Christ. They're respawnable, I guess. I did not know that. Well, I'm pretty sure... I don't know uh, where these parts are that you're talking about, guys, because I don't remember. And I'm not going to try and remember, so I'm sorry. Get out of my way. It's obvious now that those plants respawn. I wonder if the one out here respawns, too. Nope. That one doesn't respawn. Oh, are those stupid motherfuckers back again? Jesus. Please tell me I don't have to fight these assholes. Oh, 
Oh, there's more of them. Well, you know, I might as well, uh, I'll just use them individually then. Yeah, like I said, Venom Kills, that's cool. If you if you want to replay the game yourself, go go for it, man. Um, but, you know, I, I mean, yeah, I could go back, I guess. But, yeah. Eventually, you do go back, I think. I don't know. So, I'm sorry I forgot it. But, yeah. Yes, I do have 11 saves. I realize that, uh, I realize that I'm not, you know, that I don't have a minimum amount to save and all that, but, yeah. Not really streaming that. Not really streaming for the ultimate, uh, to get everything. I just want to stream the game. I really don't care about how I do performance-wise. And I don't really want to carry around the flamethrower right now. Just keep that in here too, so. This isn't really, this isn't a speed run, this isn't a run for all the achievements, this is just a normal run. And yes, I will miss stuff, and I apologize for that in advance, but, you know, whatever shit happens. Ah, god damn it. Fuck you, fuck. The red herb, I... Uh, I have a bunch of space now, might as well take it. That's what it sounds like when it opens and closes. Open it with a key. Well, finally, a reason to use the fucking gun again. You gotta love that animation how it just disappears. <laughs> I don't like shooting the gun in auto. 
I don't know why, that's just my preference, I guess. I find that auto... Auto doesn't do that much more damage. But maybe it's just me, I don't know. I'm sure it does more damage and all that. Whatever. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Oh fuck you! Come on! I pumped four fucking shots and just fuck you, asshole. Oh. And you're still alive, Jesus fucking Christ, man. Maybe I should have used this shotgun. At least you're finally fucking dead. Oh, come on! Are you dead now? Okay, good. Uh, So basically, yeah, that's all that's in there, I guess. The part. Here? No, I didn't think so. Seems like it would be an excellent room for the fucking flamethrower. Why don't I go back and get it before I explore the rest of this room? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go get the flamethrower. I'm pretty sure you need it in this room. Well, you don't need it, but it makes things a lot easier. This game looks way more badass anyways. 
mini boss or was that just like a normal freaking guy? I bet that was like a normal guy and I just wasted a bunch of shit. Oh, that's not gonna work. I need a shotgun. That means if I restart the game, uh, actually I think that was a mini boss.
Come on, shit controller, go up the ladder. Get out of my way! God, what a waste of ammo. If only I would have known those guys respawned. Not wasted all that fucking ammo. Crusades for yay, and what is this, another magnum pistol, uh, another magnum, but sweet. usually happens to me in these games. <laughs> I'm not running through like five guys. That's crazy. I mean there are people who do that but I am not going to do that. <laughs> I'm not going to master these stupid ass controls. And yes they are stupid ass. I don't care what anybody says. Actually before I do that. What's over here? Yay the modisc. I actually need that. What else is over here? Oops. Nope. Doesn't even give you anything. Okay. You. You murdered my husband. I know what you're looking for. You came for the G virus, didn't you? You'll never take it from me. This is my husband's legacy. Crazy now, bitch. Where's that spy you were working with earlier? You know who I'm talking about. What? You really don't know anything, do you? <laughs> You're so gullible. She's one of the operatives sent here by the agency. The only reason 
reason why she came here is to obtain the G-Virus. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. I discovered this when I did a background check on her. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about Umbrella. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't really care. You're about to die anyway. Yeah, crazy shit's about to go down there. You've taken the G virus. Yay! The self destruct sequence has been activated. Repeat, the self destruct sequence has been activated. This sequence may not be aborted. All employees proceed to the emergency car at the bottom platform. All employees proceed to the bottom platform. Oh yeah, 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 okay. Oh, I got it, get the fuck out of here. What did it say about her? Just restart from where I just saved. 
That's great that I missed the Magnum parts, Anyan. I'm sorry. I, I'm I'm sorry, guys, that I keep missing this stuff. You know, I'm just playing the game. You know, I'm not. I mean, yeah, the Magnum parts are pretty cool, but I'm I'm sorry, guys. I don't know what else to say. I'm not gonna go back and play that part. Of the Resident game. Evil. <laughs> Okay. Let me go.
God damn you, Ada, you dumb bitch.
Hey guys, I'm sorry before if, if I seem to get pissed off about the back parts. It's mostly because I don't care. I'm just playing the game to play the game. I'm not playing it to get everything. I mean, yeah, it kind of sucks that I forgot the back parts, but I mean, I'm just playing the game to play the game. Uh, so, I don't know. Sorry guys. I don't remember who the little girl is. I know it's in Toy Story, but yeah. Did I just beat the game? I, I think I did. I think I just beat the game. <laughs> I did! That was the fucking end of the game. Wow. Really? Huh. Interesting. I, I could have sworn there was another boss fight, but I guess not. Well, that's cool that I fought the final boss with the magnum and no yield. So yeah, that was uh, Resident Evil 2. I didn't expect to beat it this soon, but okay, that's cool. And I'm sorry I forgot the magnum parts. But as you can see, it didn't really make a difference anyway since the game was over. I know it's not the end of, you know, um, what's well, the end of Red Team Book 2 for Leon's Quest? There's Claire's Quest too, but, um, I'm not gonna do, I'm not gonna do the other quest because, um, I didn't do that in Resident Evil 1. I may come back and play those again, but since, you know, the reason for that is there's so many other games I want to play, so, yeah. It's only half the game. No, you're talking about, well, Disc 2 is Claire's. It's Claire's mission, but I, I don't know. I think, uh... I 
I think that's optional, so... I don't think I did that good on the the radio. Yeah, only rating on C. That's fucking pathetic. The best rating I got, the best ranking I got in this game, I did get an A ranking, which is not that hard to get, but yeah. The game is pretty fucking short, only six hours, so. Yeah, so, but, see, here's the thing, Onion. Like I said, I don't think I'm going to play uh, Claire's part because it's it's basically the same as the first Resident Evil, um, that it's split up into two different parts. Um, and there's so many other games I want to play. I will come back to Claire's part eventually, but I think, Yeah, I, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I want to do it. I mean, yeah, it's a good game, but there, like I said, there's many other games I want to play, so I don't know if I want to play through the second part. The second part is not, I know you say it's only the second part, but it's not. It's it's basically another game. It's the, you know, it's this. Because they both have to go through their own shit to get through the game and stuff, but I don't know. Okay, we'll try it out for a while and let me see. Because like I said, there's other games I want to play. I want to get on to. Um, I, I really want to push through to uh, Resident Evil 4 because that's the one I'm looking forward to. Um, Resident Evil 2 is good, but I don't want to, I don't want to spend, if I spent all the time to play re all the Resident Evil stuff, it would take probably like 30 hours at least. So, I don't know if I want to do that, but That's let me at least good. see, let me at least see this bar here, because I can't remember, so. Yeah, the data is Claire's data, so... And it won't let you... E okay, it does let you exit out. See, they actually got wise from the first game and let you exit out of different screens instead of locking you to it. Uh, it's true, Claire's part is much different. Um, uh, maybe... Just give me a second, I'm gonna... Mm. Ah, what the hell, fuck it. Yeah, let's do Claire's part two, so... Yeah, I, I know you have to change to this too, I know about all that. I'm just debating whether I want to do it, because see, I didn't play the second... I didn't play the other... See, um, with the first game, I only played uh, Chris's game. I didn't play as, uh, uh, what's her face? Uh, Jill. 
I didn't play as Jill Valentine in the first game, so that's my reasoning for not playing, um, not playing it here. Yes, I know how to change the disc. That's not what I am talking about. Um, I, I know about all that stuff. I'm just debating whether I want to do it or not because, like I said, there's lots of other games I want to play. I don't know if I want to dedicate this much time to this game right now. Um, but, so... Actually, I'm going to take a break anyways, guys. So let me just, uh, let me just take a break. Um, when I come back, I may play, I may play Claire's part, but, uh, most likely not because, like I said, there's other games I want to get to. Um, I don't know. But, anyways, guys, thanks for watching, uh, Resident Evil 2. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, whether I play Claire's part of Resident Evil 2, I'm not sure yet. I'm going to take a break. When I come back, I'm not sure if I'm going to play Claire's Resident Evil 2 or not. So I will definitely uh, post it for sure if I do play her part. So. Yeah, I hear what you're saying, Onion, but uh, I don't know, because, see, see, I kind of already fucked everything up, though, because I didn't play the sec, I didn't play Jill's part in the first game, and I, I guess I should have done that, uh, I don't know, choices, choices, anyways, um, like I said, I'm gonna take a break, when I come back, I may be playing, um, I may be playing the second part to Resident Evil 2, probably not because, like I said, I didn't do it for the first Resident Evil, so, but anyways guys, um, I'll be right back, so, see ya.